Hello again and welcome to Ndudu by Fafa. Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in today and as I continue the Clay Pot series. But if you have been following me for years, you will know that Clay Pot cooking is something that I do love. And over the years, I've just used this particular Clay Pot and yes, I'm going to be sharing my experience, what to do when you receive it how to clean it, and also how to maintain it. Now, if the video is too long, I will actually segment it into two. So anyway, when you do receive your clay pot, the first, and of course, after unboxing and getting over your excitement, is to give your clay pot a good scrub. And please avoid using any metal scourer to wash your clay pots as it will damage the surfaces. Absolutely not. So, of course, um, the sponge as well, it's readily available on buyindudu.com. Yes, and I'm just using my sponge with my dishwasher liquid and, of course, my tepid water. And then scrubbed everything and I'm now giving this a good rinse to make sure I get rid of any residue of the soap. The next step is to seal your clay pots before you cook with it. So once you receive it, you've done the washing, now you fill it with water till it's three quarters full. Absolutely essential, this part of sealing your clay pot. If you don't do this, it means that, of course, the clay pot is porous. So it's more likely to crack easily and for liquids to seep through the pores of the clay pot. It's a must. An important point to note, please avoid temperature stress in your clay pot. If you have a hot clay pot, avoid adding cold liquid to it. Rather, with a cold clay pot and your cold liquid, let it warm up perfectly together. So that is what I'm going to be doing here. So with the water-filled clay pots, I'm just going to place that in the oven and they're both cold. And then of course, turn the oven to 200 degrees. Now, it does take the clay pot a little bit longer to warm up. However, once it warms up, it takes an hour for it to cool down. So it means that your food is still hot for up to an hour. So there's the advantage and disadvantage there. But it is this point that cooks your food perfectly. So it's important to note. In some instances, if your clay pot is, I'll say, more porous, then you can use milk or rice water to actually seal it, yes. Um, however, so far I have used just plain water and it's been okay so far, but do bear in mind you have that option. So as I mentioned, it takes almost an hour for your clay pot to completely cool down. And this has been out for about 20 minutes and each time I just keep, you know, teasing the water so that it goes to the edges. But yeah, after that I discard the water once it's cooled down and my clay pot is ready for me to now use. So the next thing is how to store your clay pots, which is so important. It needs to be stored in an aerated space because the clay pots do need to breathe and they also need to be at room temperature as well. So yes, if you don't have um, you know, one of the racks, you could just place it on your kitchen surface and that would work perfectly. So to summarize what we've done today is, of course, receive your clay pot, give it a good scrub and then add some water to bake it. Or you've got the option of milk, bake it at 200 degrees for 30 minutes. Take it out, let it completely cool down, throw the water away, allow the clay pot to dry naturally and then store it in an aerated space. That's it. Now the next video will cover how to maintain the clay pot. Yes. So if you do like this, please leave your comments below. And yes, you will find the clay pots on buyindudu.com. I'll leave a link in the description box. And yes, we do deliver to the United States. However, please send us an email um, because it is charged by the weight for delivery, that is, and we'll be able to give you a manual quote. So don't forget to drop an email at sales at buyindudu.com. I'll leave all that in the description box below. Now, what was the next question? Discount, of course, of course. 
Now, if you really want to purchase one, drop me an email and let's see how I can help you. And yes, you will find spice blend seasonings and a lot more on buy in to do so enjoy shopping. Of course, they are either clay smoked or clay baked or clay roasted. It's all about the clay pots. Absolutely. Noel, thank you very much for my theme song. And until my next series or video, mm -hmm, take care of you. Be nice, be beautiful. Thank you very much for gracing me with your presence.